decided to focus on, on this uh, research because um, we're trying to uh, looking at unmet needs in our field in, in transplantation, particularly in kidney transplantation. And one of the main uh, unmet needs that we have is that we've realized that we do not have uh, a number of biomarkers or tools to better uh, stratify patients at risk uh, of developing rejection and therefore losing their grafts. So this has been uh, somehow the, the main objective or the main goal of our uh, research. We've uh, developed a new assay in which we believe we can refine the current way that we are stratifying patients being at rejection risk. Uh, and so our preliminary data strongly suggests and are pretty encouraging in terms that it looks like it adds new value uh, to, to better identify patients that could be or classified as low risk patients but that uh, actually could be at higher risk and therefore unpredictably uh, develop rejection. So our preliminary data are pretty encouraging and now we are in the, in the process of uh, validating these results in larger number of, of patients. We are uh, pretty optimistic. Uh, we believe it can um, somehow help transplant clinicians to better identify patients that could deserve to receive uh, some uh, different type of immunosuppression, for instance. Uh, I think the impact might be um, important uh, by using this technology.